How hard should you be breathing during cardio exercise? As we run faster, our breathing gets harder. We can actually measure this in a lab with something called a ventilatory threshold test. This is my raw data from doing a ventilatory threshold test in a lab. As you can see, the line isn't quite straight. It kind of slopes up and gets steeper over time. If we plot a line of best fit at the bottom portion and the top portion of this graph, we can actually see that inflection point where the graph gets steeper. And that corresponds to where your breathing gets harder and where it gets harder to talk. In fact, some people even plot three different lines on this graph to show two different inflection points where we get steeper on the graph. This divides the graph into three different zones, an aerobic zone, a threshold zone, and an anaerobic zone. We typically want to be in the aerobic zone where we can talk easily when we're doing our long duration runs. Our threshold runs or our tempo efforts at around race pace tend to be in that narrow threshold zone. And then our interval training is typically in that anaerobic zone above threshold. We'll talk about how much of your training should be in each of these zones tomorrow. Follow for more training tips.